brought to you by 1AAuto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. In this video, we're going to take a look and see what a bad ball joint looks like. Um, and it's on this 98 Explorer, but really, this uh, really goes for any vehicle. The ball joint connects your steering knuckle at the bottom with your lower control arm at the top. Um, and actually, on some vehicles, this can be reversed. The control arm can be on the bottom and the steering knuckle on the top. But basically, those shouldn't be able to move independently. Um, they should move together, and the ball joint should connect them securely. Okay, so right here is your ball joint. Um, and on this truck, it's really bad, so you can easily see the motion. But you can see if I just lift up on the tire, you can see the um, ball joint moving right there. Um, so what you want to do is raise your vehicle up a little bit, put a bar underneath the wheel, and wiggle it and have somebody look and see if they can see there any play up and down or side to side there as well. Okay, now here's just a close-up. These two pieces of metal should not move in relation to each other. You can see how that bottom um, gets closer to the top. That should not happen. So if you're checking your ball joint or your lower ball joint, that's what you're looking for. Um, any kind of play, um, either side to side, front to rear, or up and down uh, in that joint. And if you are seeing it, then you'll want to replace your ball joint. Um, we do sell ball joints at 1AAuto.com, and there are a couple videos on how to do it. Um, some cars are easier, some cars are more difficult, and you might want to consider a professional. We hope this helps you out. Brought to you by www.1aauto.com, your source for quality replacement parts and the best service on the internet. Please feel free to call us toll free 888-844-3393. We're the company that's here for you on the internet and in person.